from ancient times, there was a tiny land where there is fresh breeze with sea waves and a seaside which is connecting the east and west of the world. It's none other than the most beautiful emerald island of Sri Lanka known as the Pearl of the Indian Ocean. It's a place where all Sinhalese, Tamils and Muslims are enjoying freedom in temples, churches and mosques from the north to the south. It's a land where rivers are overflowing from mountain peaks and joining the Indian Ocean which reveals the sovereignty of the soil. Among these positive aspects, there are people who have not got an opportunity to acknowledge the world's intelligent, professional, religious thoughts. On this earth, out of all existence, one in a million is blessed to be a human being. Now that human is not fortunate enough to enjoy his life as a positive person. Now is this due to his fault or the fault of his family? He is being born. During this period, the Mituru Mituro movement came up with a novel idea which was spread among the teenagers to get rid of this menace. In 1987, Venerable Kupiavate Bodhananda Thera came up with fresh thoughts to deviate the Sri Lankan younger generation on the path which they were traveling from Palmadulla in the Sabaragamo province. Now we are here at the fascinating peak on a mountain in Wilhene in Palmadulla. The environment of Kiribatgala and Kutapite mountain is the birthplace of the Mituro Mituro movement which made a revolution in Sri Lanka's history. He pulled out a novel idea it starts to change the minds of teenagers and everyone within a short period. Day by day, the teenagers who were addicted to drugs and alcohol reveal from it by the thoughts of this movement where it was easy to get through to the people as the society was so calm and quiet. At this stage, the movement faced a problem to find the resources to move these thoughts further to more teenagers. Then, more government and non-governmental organizations gathered round the leader of this movement. Also, the volunteers helped them to put up more buildings to help the teenagers. After a period of 25 years, this is now a service to the society as it brought fresh lives of teenagers without losing them to the society. In the beginning, there was only one building for rehabilitation, but now there are 10 buildings where 500 people can be accommodated at once for rehabilitation, not only teenagers, but also women and children. World history is revolutionized by ordinary people like us who had thoughts of utmost desire. These youngsters will be the personalities who change and beautify their world in the future. It's our time to be a part of this movement to build a nation more clear in thoughts to make a better place.